Welcome to Ridge Life, I'm Tim. It happened again. It was a year and a half ago, January, whenever I was driving to work one morning and an, a deer came out in front of me on the highway and I slowed down as quick as I could, but it thing just jumped out demolished the front end and all down the side of my Durango SRT. And you saw how much damage that was, you know, thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars in damage. daylight we can see the damage of course the right front fender is buckled pulled off the bumper look at the the deer hair broke that completely looking at the bill here for what all this cost uh, believe it or not it was seven thousand six hundred and fifty dollars to get this damage repaired the twenty five dollars for COVID-19 uh, cleaning yeah COVID-19 cleaning they uh, fixed the front of the vehicle and the side of the vehicle but they got it all fixed up for COVID-19, $25. Well guys, I was doing a pizza run, a pizza run, just driving down the road, listening to music, minding my own business, not going fast at all. The sun was still out and sure enough, I round a corner and bam, a deer hits right in the side of my vehicle. There was zero avoidance. Check it out for yourself. This is as good a day as any To start the rebuilding of life The roads that lay open are many When the old one's gone under the knife And I can feel the sun on my skin Luckily this time the damage is not near as bad. Didn't bust the headlight out, didn't crack the windshield, didn't bust the grill, didn't do a lot of the sensor damage. I'm sure it's still gonna be thousands of dollars and I got my you know, deductible to worry about, but I'm okay and uh, you know, no one else got hurt. That is a very, very good thing. I'm so thankful for that. Um, 
but that road, man, uh, you know, th this area right here, we have a lot of deer. You know, I do my job in the fall to see if I can harvest uh, as many as I can to uh, fill the freezer and uh, keep the deer population lower in the woods. But man, that's, that's why in our area, you're allowed to harvest three doe a day. You're allowed two bucks and three doe a day for over two months. Uh, of course, I don't harvest three doe every single day for two months, but I, I do my part to uh, uh, to keep the forest with a balance in nature. But man, this time of the year, in the springtime, and, and uh, of course the fall, and the, you know, in the winter months, you know, oh man, those deer are just just jumping out in front of you everywhere. But again, the, not as much damage this time. So thankful for that. And uh, uh, we'll see how much it costs. Um, again, I just have to pay the deductible, which is a good thing. But wow hit me again. Imagine that. I am very thankful the damage was not as bad as it could have been. Uh, let's go take a look at exactly what happened to the vehicle. Let's check out this damage here. You can see it did rip the uh, wheel well uh, trim right there off, ripped it all out of these pieces right here. If you look at the very front bumper, we do have a crease right there in the front bumper. The glass, the, the headlight looks like it's okay this time. I don't see any cracks. We do see it was pushed up a little bit right here. There's a little bit of fur right there. Uh, come back around. This was right here is where the main brunt of the deer hit. You can see this is all pushed in. The door is separated. Um, of course, all the fur is up under there. And then huge, huge crease in the door right here. The paint, paint is flipping, peeling off right there. And uh, so we damaged the, the bottom piece right here as well. So we gotta get all that fixed. We try to open the door. You can see the crease. Oh yeah, pop, pop, pop. So that's not good. We'll have to get all this fixed. And you can see, luckily the tire still spins. Everything moves around fine. But again, that is not gonna be cheap. Thank you all so much for your uh, concern. I did post this on Facebook and so many of you uh, uh, said blessings that I wasn't hurt. And yes, yes, I am so thankful that I wasn't hurt as well. In the end guys, this is just a material thing, not that important uh, in the grand scheme of things. Our health is so much more important, our family, our lives. And uh, I definitely understand that. So if you haven't subscribed to Ridge Life, guys, I sure appreciate it if you take the time to do so now. Hit that notification bell to be notified anytime a new video comes out. And as always, guys, I hope everyone has a blessed, blessed day and go Ridge Life.